Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do another reading for you. I'm going to do this one a little bit differently this time. This reading may or may not be for you. This reading is not sign specific, nor is it time specific. This is just something I was called to do. I already did one today, but I did it in the morning, and I always do them at night, so it feels like I needed to do another one, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. So we're going to use the Energy Oracle deck, and we're also going to use this deck right here by Ciro Marchetti. This is the Retrospective Tarot. So yeah, we're going to use that one too. Uh, let's just see what comes up. What do we got, dear God, angels, spirits, and universe? What do we got? What kind of message do I need to deliver with these cards? That's a good one. Yin and Yang. This is uh, opposites. This is opposite polarities. Good versus evil. Uh, right versus wrong. Positive versus negative. Hmm. This is uh, working to be together to complete a whole. Twos are about partners. A union coming together, working together. There's opposites, but these opposites can work very, very well together. Masculine and feminine energy, both. Hmm. Working for the highest good, or doing something together for the best benefit, by the looks of things. Envy. Ooh, self-love, fourth chakra. That is about self-love. I love. It's about love. But we have somebody here that is jealous and envious. It's like they have an opportunity, but they're not taking it. This person is uh, kind of a victim. They may see themselves as a victim. It's like they want to have it all, but they're, they may act in a pitiful manner. We have another two here. So it's like they, they're just not taking action to bring their own success. They sit in a, a, a place of envy. So, But two, 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 two. The twos are about faith and trust. So somebody is needing to have faith and trust in something. Twos are also about foundations. They're about couples. They're about partners. Somebody may be jealous that they don't have a partner. They may, may be upset, really wanting a partner, looking for the one that is going to complete them. You know, you really are, are a whole. You complete yourself, but we all have that need, that, that desire for the perfect match. Now, this is I love the fourth chakra. This is the heart chakra, which is self-love. I love healing. So we have a healing. Healing of the heart. Journey. I knew we were going to get this card, too. I saw it. That's why I picked up this deck, because I was I was planning on getting this card. I was. I thought, oh, i got to get the Journey card, and look at what number it is. It's another two. Somebody is traveling towards their perfect match. They're following their heart. Okay. So, uh, and this is equals, uh, that's an 11, and what, and what is 1 plus 1? Another 2. So basically we have all 2's here. Huh. The time is now. The time is now, because if you, 2, 4, 6... Eight, nine, ten. I'm just, I'm, I'm trying to add too much in my head. Ten. So we, the time is now to come together with some partner. Okay, twos are about partnerships. Twos are about soulmates. They're soulmate connections. You're on the right track. This is the beginning of a new foundation. Somebody is taking a journey towards the one that is going to help their heart be healed leaving all leaving something behind somebody is is moving it's like they're going someplace else 
Somebody is going someplace else. So they're saying goodbye. They're leaving something behind. And there's a healing that is about to happen. This person may have been envious, may have been jealous, may have been wanting to have it all. But for some reason they couldn't. They may have been trapped in their own mind or they may have been trapped in a situation that they that they just felt like they couldn't get out of. Um, but I feel as though things, something is about to happen because somebody is headed in a new direction. And they're leaving something behind. It's like they're packing up their bags and they're leaving. And they're coming together with somebody that they can, you know, work very, very well with. Very interesting. Oh, okay. Another two. This is the Nine of Wands, the Two of Coins, Reverse. There's been, somebody's made some poor decisions. Somebody may have made some poor decisions to uh, not let somebody have what they wanted. I don't know. Uh, oh, yeah. Moon reversed. Seven of Cups. A decision is being made. This is a time of hope. It's a time of inspiration. This is a wish being granted. Somebody's wish is being granted. And it is from, this is like a guardian angel. I feel as though there is some sort of angelic guidance here. Twos, okay, so that equals a four. And if you add these equals four, and that's an angel. So anyway, angels, angels are here. Anyhow, I know they are. I wouldn't have said it. So, Knight of Cups, we have a relationship. We have a new relationship that is about to blossom. There could be a rebirth in a relationship. Somebody it could be coming in with emotional support. This could be somebody that comes to sweep you off your feet. They come to take you away. They come to your rescue. It's like so, this is a wish being granted, okay? This is a wish being granted. This is a dream come true. It's like somebody has made a decision to walk away from something or somebody has come in to take them away to help them. Now this could be somebody that has already passed away. This is protection. This is protection like from heaven the star card is. It's heavenly protection. So somebody may be protecting somebody and moving them to a better place, giving them the guidance, showing them the light, showing them the way. This is the light being shown. So yes, this is coming out of a uh, bad situation, a dark situation. Somebody made a poor decision based on jealousy by this, by the looks of things. The Nine of Wands, there's there's uh, hard feelings. Somebody may have made a decision, something to do with hard feelings and jealousy. Five of Coins reversed. This is coming out of the darkness. Five of Coins. That is the meaning of the card. Five of, five of Pentacles reversed. It's coming as the end of difficulty. It's coming out of the darkness. It's... It's somebody was abandoned or they may have felt abandoned or they are abandoning a situation. They may have an abandoned somebody. This is abandonment. Somebody may have made a poor decision to abandon somebody. I don't freaking know. Oh, a partner, another two. We got a lot of twos here. I got a cough. I'm sorry. I got a, I got a head cold. Pretty good one, too. <coughs> Stuffy nose, whole nine yards. Anyhow, um, this, this is, we have a, definitely we have, this is all about relationships. This is all about partnerships with all these twos. I mean, I mean two is the most prominent number here. Okay. Somebody is... Uh, it's almost like they're removing themselves from one partnership and they're headed towards somebody else that um, 
they have been wishing for. You know, they're they're going somewhere that is going to fulfill them. It's going to make them very happy. It's like, this is, I can't believe this is happening. This is surreal. This is surreal. So this is a healing love. Somebody, a decision is being made to go in a new direction. Somebody has really received some sort of clarity. They, they, they see, they see that, uh, <laughs> They were involved in somebody else's poor decision. You know what I mean? It's like they were abused. They were abandoned. They were, uh, oh, what is the word for it? It's like they were used. That's the only word that I can think of. And I think this, we have somebody here that realizes that they were being used and they decide to take, or they be, Somebody, somebody decides this is a decision being made that love is more important, that love is more important than anything else. We have two people coming together that are meant to come together. We talked about this, the same kind of reading that we had this morning. So even though it's even though it's nighttime now, it's the same kind of reading, different cards. We have two people coming together that are meant to come together after we have an envious person that got in the way. We already talked about this in this morning's reading. Somebody made a poor decision and got themselves involved with a jealous individual who was trying to prove something. I don't know to who trying to prove something to somebody, and now the truth is coming out with that moon card reversed. The truth is coming out, and somebody is taking back control of a situation with the, with, the, with the magician card. It's like the power is about to be regained. Somebody is finding their power, their resources to take action, to get out of a uh, shady situation. Anyhow, um, we have the end of one partnership and the beginning of a new one. Same message we had this morning. Different words, different cards. Um, it's the end of a difficult period. It's the diff end of abandonment. It's the end of not being loved. This is I love, the fourth chakra. So this is about being loved. It's, it's like replacing a lack with love. So be prepared. That is what we have coming up. It's all about love. It's all about building a foundation, building a partnership, working together, um, dealing with uh, the opposition that comes along the way. I feel like the time is now. I think that balance is about to be restored. A decisions are being made. That's what two's about. Two's are about decisions. Two's are about choices. Obviously, somebody made some poor choices, but it's like things are changing. They are changing. It's like, yeah, somebody may have been hiding the truth. Maybe they may have been lying. And it was all based on jealousy. But we have somebody here that is now, has now been protected. And it's like now they see the truth. There's no more illusion. And they're looking for something more. And it feels like somebody comes to help them. Somebody comes to help them uh, leave or help them make that decision. Somebody is making a decision. Somebody has or they have made the decision that love is what matters. And that is where I'm going. So be prepared. Somebody is, is headed right towards love. Okay? Headed right towards love. So that is what I got. Good luck.